Hi everyone, Great Power 60 here. I'm just having my after supper tea. I'm just going to put that over here for a minute. Alrighty. I hope that's not shining too much. But if it is, I'll uh, fix it. I've got a bit of a haul. Okay. I went to Dollar Tree. I went to Michael's. So let's start off with Dollar Tree. I picked up these pretty pansies, I think they're called. Yes, they are pansies. And I believe I picked up two, with, one with blue ones in it. And then I picked up these beautiful dahlias and they're um, blue. And I don't know why I have a thing for blue flowers. I don't know why that is. I picked up one of these. Let me just grab everything out of here, out of this one bag. Because I have another bag. And I thought I would share my hauls with you. Now I got a Michaels and I've got a Dollar Tree. Alrighty, so flowers. We'll put those over there. I picked up one of these craft bottles. It's a smaller one. And I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with it, but I got larger ones. But I think I have something I'm going to create with that. I picked up this cute little purse, this little, um, I guess it's, what do, what do we call it? A cosmetic bag. It's a little cosmetic bag. And I'm going to be using that in my giveaway um, to put some goodies in. Just going to put that over there. They had these Stouffer marshmallow and caramel eggs, well, different kinds. I picked up the marshmallow and caramel, um, two for a dollar, so or a dollar twenty-five or a dollar. I can't remember. Oh, and I picked up these gloves for mom. I hope you can see what I'm doing here. I didn't check my camera properly today, and uh, let's hope that you can see a little bit better. There we go. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> oh, and I picked up these gloves for mum. I picked up two of these mailer envelopes. What else did I pick up there? And I picked up another one of these candy cotton bags. Uh, my son loves cotton candy, and I don't get it very often for him, but anyway. That's who, that's who's getting that. I also picked up these cute dark blue socks. I like buying these um, for the winter. And then I picked up these heavier uh, gloves for, um, to leave in the car when I have to um, shovel snow around my car, which has been a lot lately. And I'm digging in here. And these are four for a dollar twenty-five. So I picked up some petunias, marigolds, dips of villa, baby's breath, and carrots. I think I picked up some carrots. I have some natural ones somewhere, but I want to see how these do as well in my little gardening project that I'm going to be doing as soon as the weather gets nice. Now, I usually buy Easter eggs. These are not Easter eggs, as far as I'm concerned. These are shells, but I thought they would have been really nice to, um, when you're, you know, when you're sending racks or whatever, um, I don't do swaps, so I just like to send things out. You can fill them up with some goodies, and I just thought they were a pretty addition to do that. Um, it's a little too early for me to buy anything for the kids for um, Easter, so. And I picked up this. I hope you can see it all really well. It's the most adorable 
wall decoration. Easy on, easy off. Let me see. I hope you can see it well. Let's see if you can see it really well. I really need better lighting. Let me, let me, let me. There, how's that? Got the white light on. Isn't that adorable? Um, who was it? Who was it? I was watching. Oh, it was um, <coughs> uh, No Guts, No Glory. She was saying when she sends out packages, she buys these wall decoration things and uses them to put on the packaging. And I thought, oh, this is lovely. Now, I don't even know how much is in there, so... Maybe it's just that. Oh, no, there's some on the back. Look at that. That is gorgeous. Wouldn't you love to get a package with these on it? I just think that is such a wonderful idea. So I grabbed this, and I think I might go back and get a couple more because they're just so pretty. And I thought that was a really cute idea. They finally got these back in. Um, these are binder pouches, and... Um, what's great about these, I can put the smaller ones in here. This is for my, my, um, binders that I have because I had run out of these. Oh, I thought I bought four. I guess I bought five, two, four, five. Oh, well, that's okay. And I did get the purple one, the binder pouch for my, um, <sighs> stickers. As you know, the way I... Um, set them up but what I like is with this extra little pocket I can put the smaller ones in here and the bigger ones so those are going to be going in my binder so I can finish organizing my um, my my stickers right now I have them in a bin and it's great because I can flip through them but it's taking up valuable space and I really liked um, being able to open a binder and flip through what I want to look for and I like that idea so that's going over there if I can reach there we go okay what else have I got oh and I picked up some oops my tea I picked up some more just mailing labels for my printer I have some things to send off the uh, card and envelope sets, I get those once in a while uh, just to save me some time with some of my other um, uh, my other card stock that I use. I like to use these once in a while, so I bought this one. This is the kind of vanilla color. I call it vanilla or buff. And then um, Crafter Square... The other glue that I always used was, oh, what's the name of it? It's just a, it's just a craft glue like this, clear, and I found it worked pretty good. So I thought I'd give this one a try because I don't know if it's just new labeling or if it's, you know, if it's the same glue or not, but it comes in pretty handy. I kind of like it, kind of like it. Let's see what else I've got in here. I've also got a Michaels haul, so I'll show you. I picked up this book, and it's uh, and it's even got an envelope for you to mail. And it's do more of what makes you happy. And when you open it, it's got all kinds of encouraging words. I know this is is this is um, shining all over the place, but you only live once. But if you do it right, once is enough my may west the other one is nothing is impossible the word itself says i'm possible impossible audrey hepburn light today with tomorrow and try to be a rainbow in someone's cloud i just love these kind of books and i love to send those off so that is going to be saved now i saw this i am sure it's, it was in the teaching tree area. It's over, it's an over the chair storage. I have no idea 
how big these are, so why not open it now and find out? I got a pink and a purple one. I just want to, I just want to see the size of it. I thought it was maybe by looking at this, and then after I thought, oh, it must be a kid's chair. So let's see. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I think the trouble is the way it makes it look is that the they took the chair apart and put that through. So I don't know. It's almost like you can use it as a... It was kind of a... I mean, let's face it. It's a cheapy thing. Here. So this is the back of it, and it's got these elastics. I'm trying to think of... A, do I have... Oh, I have a chair behind me. Now, I'm going to move the camera, so don't mind the mess. Please. Don't mind the mess. I'm getting everything organized for a few things. All right. Here's my chair that I brought in from the live dining room. So let's put this on here just to see. Wow, look at that. And that just hangs. So you could put books in here. I'm just trying to fill it up with stuff so you could get a good look. That's kind of a cool idea, actually. I mean, great for kids, too, but also for us crafty people. We want to just put some stuff in there. I don't know. Kind of kind of like it, kind of don't. What do you think? What do you guys think? I don't know. <laughs> so that's it for my Dollar Tree haul. Thanks for joining me, and we'll see you again soon. Sorry for the voiceover. My uh, video screwed up a little bit. See you soon. Bye for now.